We're expecting over 200,000 guests at the Alaska Wildlife Conservation Center this summer. They all hope to come here and get up close and personal with a lot of iconic Alaskan wildlife. Here we go, a little bit closer. Every day we're putting on a whole bunch of education programs and talks for visitors from our wolves. We're sick of deer. And a fan favorite, our red fox. So we do have two red foxes in here. Jade is a male and Storm is a female. What is that? So I'm giving them a little bit of enrichment today. It's a scent of squirrel. <laughs> We're gonna see how they feel about it. They might roll around in it a little bit later. Even though Storm looks like an Arctic fox, she is genetically a red fox. How do you feel, Hannibal? Storm was just bred to be that color for the exotic pet trade. She was seized as someone's illegal pet, and then she was relocated here with us. The people who had her did remove her canine teeth, so that's why she can't be released out. Jade's story is a little bit different. He was actually found on a hiking trail in Anchorage by some people. Mom was probably nearby, but they did pick him up and bring him down to AWCC. By the time I went to go find the mom, she was no longer around. What do you think, Jade? So our foxes right now have been living underneath what we call the bunkhouse, where we keep our seasonal and intern staff. And then they also share the barn with the moose. Yeah, there you go. So the big thing coming up for Jade and Storm, they're getting a whole big new upgrade. They're going from this decent sized area to this whole brand new, huge, huge area. I've been working with them for six years now, since Jade first got here. And well, it's kind of a lot, like if I had kids, it'd be like watching my kids doing really well. So I'm, I'm excited to see it. All right, guys, we're gonna sneak our way out of here. Thank you guys all for coming out. Jade, Jade, Jade.